Good morning, day 25. Day 26. Oh, and it's a big day. <laughs> and uh, it's his birthday. birthday. Woo! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sydney. Happy birthday to you. Woo! Yay! It's 18. 18 today. Swedish. 18 today. Oh, let's do the Swedish one. So, uh, none of us know the actual words. You know Yamo de leva, Yamo de leva, Yamo de leva, Don Traya. Yamo de leva, Yamo de leva, Yamo de leva, Don Traya. Hurrah! 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 We think we know those words, but we, we think we're probably saying them all wrong. Surprises. But we're heading off to the arch today and then off to Mammoth Cave to see if we can get into Mammoth Cave. And if we can't do Mammoth Cave today or early tomorrow, then we it's just a stopover. Yep, yep, yep. And then it's just a stopover and we move on to Tennessee because the it's Kylie's senior trip. She gets to pick because Mammoth was her one park she wanted to go to. And so she said, if it's not happening, we abort and just move on to Tennessee because unanimously Tennessee is the... And Sid is picking destination of choice. Sid is picking dinner tonight for her birthday. Okay. But she's gonna pick at dinner time. She doesn't know yet. Okay. Got to think ahead on that because we're gonna be in a small town in Tennessee. No, no, no. No. Kentucky. Kentucky. And we'll let you know when the nearest big city is because it gets to be a very small town. And so I'm talking do like a birthday lunch. Like we'll be having lunch at or having birthday dinner at Bob's Country Store. You know, like or, diesel and or a Roadkill Cafe. Roadkill Cafe. There we go. We're looking good to go. Woo! <laughs> this is the most beautiful national park I've ever been to. This place is arch parking, it says. Really? Really? Okay. Well, then what do you do? Arch parking. $7 parking? Yeah, we're not parking there. Alright. So we're here. We have arrived. And the only place that we were able to find to park is a pay parking lot that's teeny tiny. And so we were coming around the block to find where else we might be able to park. Here's the arch. It's very beautiful. Very beautiful. 13 or 15 foot bridge clearance down there. I avoided one that was 8 feet, which now it turns out you come to. And I'm not sure I can get under it. 8 feet, 3 inches. That's close because it's 8 feet. So we're going to do our selfie here on the bench with the arch. And then we're going to keep moving. Yeah, if we take the picture here, we get a good picture of the arch. Picture of the arch. There we go. All right, here's me turning our camper around because that bridge is so low and putting my camper on this sidewalk. Like many others have done, you can see, that's hilarious. You can see, uh, let me make sure I don't hit the bench. You can see all kinds of tire tracks. People doing this, that's hilarious. There we go. All right, here we go. Done. I gotta say this, we're, we're surrounded by cool old buildings and I just wanted to point that out. This is a really cool old section of town. Nothing going on though, like it is completely dead. That which is weird, because it's summer and you would think it would just swarming with tourists. I don't know, anyway, dead. Some cities and check out this old train or this old bridge with a, a little cutout for this diesel engine to go through. That's so cool. Just right there. So there goes the arch. Everybody went to the museum except for Toby and I. We, we sat in the car. We went through the museum. When you walked through, we didn't like wander through it. Or okay, okay. It. It so apparently it's pretty awesome and I'll never get to be here again, but yeah. I, I would have walked through it for 13 seconds anyway, so I'm not gonna make a spiel of it. But right there you go, arch. Bye bye arch. Off we go now to Tennessee. Oh, but I will say we are crossing the Mississippi River, which is significant on any road trip. Any minute now, any minute. I do love old portions of the city and they're like completely redoing that portion down there. It's very cool. It's not ready yet, but it will be. And it'll be a cool section. Here we go, old, old bridge. Old bridges everywhere you look. This side looks pretty neat. Factories and train cars, pretty crazy. I'm loving all the uh, Mississippi River stuff though. And then, are we in a new state, or is this still Missouri? Missouri or Kentucky? What are we in now? Hold on, let's wait for it. Oh, Illinois. What? What? Yeah, I think we're in Illinois. No way. 
Yep, Illinois 3. Great River Road of Illinois. Choose life, pray, pray, pray. Venmo. Venmo, that's it. All right, so I think we just entered Illinois. Yeah. So maybe welcome to Illinois? Yeah, we're in Illinois as soon as we cross the Mississippi. Ah. <laughs> welcome to Illinois! Woo! -hoo -hoo! Good times, good times. <laughs> Oh, a landfill! Welcome to Illinois. Here's a landfill. That's fun. Yeah, we're back east for sure. Cities are run down. The roads are crappy. Oh, this is a brand new bridge. It feels lovely. Some kind of church steeple that's actually made from the Weather Dominator. It's the Cobra headquarters. And we're in the city of East St. Louis. Illinois' finest name drop. Welcome to Indiana! Woo! We're gonna be in Indiana for like two miles, I think. <laughs> we'll go see. Are we gonna enter the next state? I think so. I got a hunch. It's a river and a massive bridge. I'm thinking it's gonna be Kentucky. Welcome to Davies County. Home of Katie Bouchard, Miss Kentucky. 2018. I don't know. No welcome to Kentucky. Well, not according to any official signage. Mile 13? How not going to be mile 13 already. We just got here. I don't know. <coughs> Still no sign. I guess welcome to Kentucky. Not sure. We'll see if there's a sign. Kentucky! Uh, I'm not sure about it. So we've driven through rain most of the day, heavy rain most of the day. And this is what we've arrived at. The rain is still just behind us. It's right over there. But I hope we can at least get checked in, drop the trailer and go back and check out the cave to see if we can get a walk-in pass for tomorrow. But here we are. This is Horse Cave. KOA. We've arrived. The visitor center should be open for another 28 minutes, fortuitously. We can at least go scope it out and see if there's anything available for us tomorrow. Here's the visitor center. This is my favorite visitor center. I think in the whole park system that we've seen. When you get inside, it's got these huge beams. That it might be different. Very cool vista. Oh, do we need masks? We might need masks. We have to ask because of the cave. All right, so here's the visitor center. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, it's beautiful. That was not open last time we were here. And this is the... What a view. Love this place. So cool. Okay. Let's go see about tickets and tours. We found out what we needed to know, which was the tours leave tomorrow at 9.30, and then we won't know if they're available until 9.20. So that you said there's no reason to show up before that. It's still raining, so I went to Walmart and bought one of these covers. Had some dinner, got some birthday cakes, and we're looking at the view. That's where we celebrate Sydney's birthday again. This is a very cool KOA. The highway's right there, which leads to Mammoth Cave. You got the lodge house, but check these things out. These little pretend Conestoga wagon things. They're neat. And it almost looks like they actually are wagons. They have real axles and real wheels, and they're bolted to the ground. Huh, oh, okay. But then, as if that wasn't cool enough, you know, you have your campsites like any other place. But check these out. Tree houses. I said to Linz, well, we haven't built a tree house yet. Because we're talk talking about other cool things we can do. Maybe a motorcycle trip. Maybe do a mini Winnie trip where we got to drive like a camper van. Um, but yeah, haven't built one of those yet. That'd be cool. Blow the smoke. Right, hurry up. Happy birthday hey, to you. you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sydney. Happy birthday to you. And then are you going to COVID blow them out? Oh, it looks like the Yay. wind did it too. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, we uh, can I have a piece with that? You get the whole cake. I don't know that anybody else eats red velvet. Just take the whole thing. She can eat it with a fork, like legit. 
Does anybody else want to try red velvet? No, I will. Uh, t- a small amount. Color. So Isaac wants a piece. When I don't like it, my teacher have made most. me try red velvet in I think third or fourth grade, and I hated it. I, I, don't, I, I want I the want smallest. It's like a little smiley face. It looks like an owl. You're making an owl out of her cake. That is so cool. You're very nature oriented. Oh, Mothman! It does look like an owl though. There are no forks, but I can give you a spoon. I'll take it. Spoon it is. Forks on the camera. Yeah, but nobody feels like getting those. Yeah. That's Alrighty, this will be the first time we've had a Walmart cake in two years because I don't think we had any in 2020. Well, I, I think I'll prefer that. Oh, this is still perfect. Oh, here. Thank you very much. Oh, here's. Okay. What's that camper feeling like in there? I wonder. Probably not awesome. Go shut those bathrooms. How do you want white hair? Can we get set up for it, please? Wow. No. <laughs> you have to use your bare hand. I mean, I will. <laughs> I will also do it. It matches your shirt exactly. Yeah. That's crazy. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Can I have a fork with someone? Thank you. Oh, sorry. Can I have a fork with someone? Can I have a piece of cake? Oh, man. Okay, I'm done. You don't like cake. <laughs> really? Yeah, I don't like cake. Oh, okay. here's. Well, that's that. The next stop is uh, Mammoth Cave. We've decided we are doing it. It was it was on the table as to whether we might or might not go, but we're doing it. Uh, Sid's never seen it, and I really want her to see it. And she was like, "I want to go see it," so I was like, "Bam, done." So tomorrow is Mammoth Cave. Adios. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to check out our other videos on YouTube.